Sepsis can be triggered by pneumonia, surgery, even childbirth. Symptoms include fever, increased breathing, and confusion. The body's defense system goes out of control, causing widespread inflammation, organ failure, and septic shock, where blood pressure drops to a dangerously low level. Scientists at Harvard University's Viss Institute are working on a new dialysis system that cleans the blood of poisonous pathogens before they trigger that deadly inflammatory response. The current standard of therapy is to give antibiotics and fluids. But what we're talking about here is treatment for sepsis. The researchers are filtering blood through a tube with tiny mesh fibers coated with an engineered protein called FCMBL. They bind the cell wall of bacteria, of fungi, of many viruses, of many parasites, and they bind to toxins as well. Mike Super describes the procedure. We're coating the inside of the tubes with that protein, and then we're running the infected blood from the patient through that, through the filter, and binding, adsorbing, capturing the pathogens that are in that blood, so that the blood that's going back to the patient after the dialysis is cleansed. In a trial phase using rats, the dialysis treatment was more than 99% effective in filtering out deadly bacteria. The research team hopes to begin human trials soon, in hopes of saving many lives around the world. Deborah Block, VOA News, Washington.